Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Manchester United facing Porto. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. They do pass the ball with authority. Not high quality defending. Good tackle, take it away. Can he give them the lead? And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Goal one for nil the Number 47, Phil Foden. Gakpo. Well read to ease the pressure. Dembele. Danger averted. Phil Foden. Joshua Kimmich. Kimmich. Foden. Superb save from Bruno Lloris. And the header just wide of the mark. Dembele, Fernandez. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Eder Militao, Hakimi. Well, getting close to the half-time break, and United with a bit of work to do here. Stuart, how would you assess their performance in the first half? Well, it's been a fairly even first half so far, but they haven't shown enough creativity, particularly in midfield, where there's been too many negative passes. If they can get the ball into the front areas that little bit quicker, I think they'll get back into this. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Gakpo. And Bellingham, will they get themselves level here? Oh, he's missed it! Well, he'd be very disappointed with that. He should be scoring from there. Alfonso Davies, Fernandez. Pele, and on to Bellingham. And he's made headway. And a goal here, just what Manchester United required. They are level. Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. Here's a change for Manchester United. Goal so back underway following the equaliser. Number five. Well, no stopping him. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Bellingham. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. And cleared away. Simple catch, really. And he clears the danger. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Manchester United on the front foot in the closing moments. Can they find a winner? Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power. The keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. 
so deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. And that wasn't a million miles away, almost the equaliser. Well, it's not a bad effort, is it? But they've got to find a way back into this one. And there it is, the final whistle. It's a Manchester United victory. Well, Derek, what a good finish the game that was. They just wore down the opposition, and in the end, they got their reward. That's a really good win for them. Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone, and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It is Bayern Munich taking on Manchester United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And it might be Tony Kors. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Must take the lead here. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Hakimi. Teammates available. Difficult to stop him, but the danger averted for now. Pele. Dembele. Pele. Dembele. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Well, that's the end of that for now. Tony Kors. Butragenia. This is Kors. Moving into the advanced position. Still could be dangerous. And there it is. A goal. I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. 2-0 now, and back underway. Clears it away. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Would the club secretary please note that Mr. Moon is in the building? The second half underway, and United left with a real mountain to climb. Oh. 
Jude Bellingham. Nice looking pass. And the danger is averted. Bayern pushing forward with options available. Course. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. It will be a Bayern corner. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Just the clearance that was needed. Got to it easily, the keeper. Eder Militao. Fernandes. Gakpo. Alfonso Davies. Jude Bellingham moving the ball nicely looking for that final pass fluency of movement and keeping it out and they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game well, he failed to get it away properly has a go and the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Well, can he get one back? Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, as you can see, that's a great bit of skill. He times this so sweetly. What a good goal that is. So continuing with the action, United still behind, but this game very much a contest. Hakimi. Enzo Fernandez. Pele. And there's the final whistle. The grim news from the Manchester United point of view is that United haven't picked up anything from this game. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me. And obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Real Madrid versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Rabio. Diaby. Well, not cleared away completely. Danger averted for now. Dembele. More than decent this from United. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Emilio Butragueño, Rabio, Butragueño, still level here, but the pressure escalating, can he put them in front? So a corner kick it'll be, following the deflection. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Popping up defensively. Please report to the main gate to meet your family. Alfonso Davies. 
Enzo Fernandez. Gakpo. Fernandez. And a goal from Antoine Griezmann. And that ought to give his team a massive filling. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely Manchester goal. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Putragenio. Well, this could level it. Not really the ideal clearance. And a time for calm on the ball. Many. And there it is, the half time whistle. Coming up at half time, don't forget we'll be having the lucky raffle and also don't forget the lucky program draw. The second the half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Hakimi, Riesman. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Awarded to Manchester United. And the problem not completely solved. Well, a top notch piece of defensive judgment. Griezmann. Now Griezmann. Fernandez. Can he find the right pass? But nothing comes of it. Well, decided to test the keeper. But no problems, really. Enzo Fernandez Trying to really get at the opposition here. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. 20 minutes to go. Advantage, Manchester United. Well, every second must seem rather like a minute if you're a United fan. They're almost there, almost over the line. In position, and a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. 2-0 now, and back on the way. Griezmann. Hakimi. Now Griezmann. The referee, well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Moussa Diaby. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of that performance also? Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say.
I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Manchester United up against West Ham United. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Now there to intercept. Pele. Casemiro. Wendia. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Can they nudge in front? Still possibilities. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Attention, Kartik Jairman. Steven Gerrard. And he's through here. Kartik Jairman. In it goes. The please. opening goal Thank of this you. contest. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. Goal. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Bizarre's credit for winning the ball back. Dembele. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. And a goal here! Just what Manchester United required. They are level. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. Goal. It's a lovely goal. Manchester United. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Would the club secretary please note that Mr. Moon is in the building. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Gerard. It did look on for them, but not to be. Emiliano Buendia. Conte. He takes aim. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. Corner conceded. It came off the defender. And opting for power over placement, but not the desired result. So half an hour remaining. Bellingham. Griezmann. The timing was perfect. It had to be. Pele. Marcos Acuna. Still not clear. Can he put them in front? And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, here it is again. And the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area. Just poor defending all round. And they're making a change. Goal. Well, the dramatic Best moment near the end, and that Number might seven. well be the decider. Time is against Manchester United, but it's not over for them. The clearance wasn't decisive. 
Well, threat about it. But it comes down to the final five minutes. Can he finish them off? And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, as you can see, he's a dangerous runner with the ball. He has such good balance and pace. That's a top-class goal, isn't it? Well, they've decided to make a change. Goal. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline. And the referee blows for full time. The big headline here, defeat for United. Your assessment of the game. You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball. And then just a few mistakes at the back, and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It is Liverpool up against Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Cleared away comprehensively. Dembele. Griezmann. Dembele on the ball. Can they convert? And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. goal. And Liverpool Manchester gets the ball moving again, looking to find a reply to that setback. Looking for Mane. Liverpool in a position of menace. It's still alive. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, here it is again. And I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with. But where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets the ball first. And it's a good finish. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Alfonso Davies. Wonderful challenge. And a throw in coming up. Continues his run. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Mo Salah. Or is Charleson. Well, you've got to say, comfortably off target, Stuart. Yeah, that's a waste of good possession. His teammates are not happy with him, and they're letting him know. Jude Bellingham. Dembele on the ball. And still for them to produce something exciting. And really tried to blast that one past the keeper, but his radar was a bit off. Well, no danger now. And so it is, the first half story has been written. May I please remind you that racism will not be tolerated in any form and offenders will be removed from the stadium. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Oh, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Dembele. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. 
Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Throw in to Manchester United. Griezmann. Fine challenge from Pele. Opportunity it is. Thirty minutes to go then. Pele. And it took a touch on the way through, so a corner here. Here it is now, a substitution. It did look on for them, but not to be. Jude Bellingham. Bellingham. Went in strongly, decisively. Losing possession here. Just 15 minutes remaining. Bellingham. A glorious chance. Only five minutes left for play and tension galore with the teams locked together. Well, slightly off target and that'll be a throw in. They will now make use of the substitute's bench. Bellingham. So the final whistle, even Steven in the end. A draw from the Liverpool point of view. What did you think? Well done. A draw is a fair result in the end because they never really looked in full control of the game, which is disappointing when you consider the quality of their squad. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football, perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It is Manchester United taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Getting the ball forward. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Patient build-up at the moment. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Mane, can he give them the lead? A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Sadio Mane. Well, he could really get at the opposition. A wonderful intervention. Jude Bellingham. Fernandez. Well, he took care of it defensively. He's in here. Clears it away. Richarlison. Top class defending. And with the goalkeeper. to do well it's a great piece of goalkeeping so quick off his line 
So nearing the half-time interval and United facing a deficit as things stand. Stuart, how would you sum up the performance in the first half? Well, it's been a tight first half so far, but they haven't quite shown enough guile in the attacking third. If, however, they can be more dynamic in the 1v1 situations, they have the quality to turn this around. With the club secretary, please and with that, the first Miller half draws to a game. close. And the referee gets the second half going. Liverpool with the lead. Will they be able to hold on to it? And he was being pressed, but did his job. And Pele won the ball. Liverpool have it once again. Well, it could be on for him here. And it didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. So making the substitution now. Out of play, United throw in coming up. Now we're into the final half hour. Bellingham. Pele. Is it going to be? Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. And it's in. A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Goal for Manchester Now they're going to United. alter things. Here's the substitution. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Mane. And Bellingham. And it might be... And the danger is averted. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. It's going to be United's free kick. Bellingham. A very timely interception. Level it is. Closing moments here. Can Liverpool find a winner? Well, not the best clearance. A oh, good hit, good save. Pedri. Bellingham. Ruben Dias. Pele. And so the final whistle has sounded, and this match ends in parity. From the Liverpool point Thank of view, what did you make of it? Well, Derek, safe, they're yeah. normally the better team, but that wasn't the case today because it was a below-par display, and they just have to switch their focus to the next match now. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Manchester United taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Well, here's the replay. And what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed. And it's a comfortable finish in the end. 
which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. goal and the ball moving again. What sort of response Number will we see from them now? Jude and that is offside. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Pele. It should be. And throwing himself up the ball. Well, not great on the accuracy front. Goal kick here. Pele. Good looking pass. This could square the game. It's gone in beyond the goalkeeper. And Liverpool are level. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top class player. Goal. So back on the way. One goal apiece here. This attack looks highly promising. Griezmann. And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. Well, the action continues. Is there to be a response from Number Liverpool eight. now? There and needs to be. Well read to ease the pressure. Pele. Nuno Tavares. Jude Bellingham. Pele. Well, slightly off target. And that'll be a throw in. put it in and a goal to really bolster things for them two in front well as you can see he hits this with so much power but just look at the follow through so athletic that's a dynamic strike goal. so the ball is moving again he's been treated to four goals three one the score Jude and so it is the first half story has been written well, into the second half, and an uphill climb for Liverpool after the events of the first 45 minutes. Making sure nothing came of it. Mo Salah. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Well, nothing comes of it. Oh, great vision. Jude Bellingham, Dembele, Pele, a danger here as he runs at them, it's going to be United's free kick, now they're going to alter things, here's the substitution, well he almost nodded that one in, Fernandez. Dembele and that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line Ali Musrati well we have 20 minutes left in this game Dembele teammates available Griezmann on to Hakimi. Dembele on the ball. Well, Manchester United all powerful. They've accelerated away in this one, Stuart. 
Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes. Can he get one back? And it's in! They've eaten into their advantage, and this is not over. Not yet, anyway. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. And they will make the change now. On with the game, then. 3-2. What will happen next? The sound of the referee's whistle and the headline here, Liverpool lose. Your assessment of the performance? Yes, Derek, they were well off their usual standards today and with the quality that they have in their squad, I think it's fair for the fans to demand more. Too many bystanders for me, just not good enough. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It is Liverpool taking on Manchester United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Read it superbly to take back possession. Flag raised for offside. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Bellingham. High quality defending. Man. Strong but fair tackle. Might be onto something with that ball. Encouraging stuff from United. Must take the lead here. Oh my goodness! He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, as you can see, that's a great bit of skill. He times this so sweetly. What a good goal that is. Well, Liverpool restart the game. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. Or is Charleson. And the header just wide of the mark. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. It's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, here it is again. First to the ball, clever header and a good finish. He's done really well there. Goal so back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Number 10. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. And a fine tackle. Over the top, into the stride of Sadio Mane. Could reduce the deficit. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. A goal as they cut into their advantage. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here's the replay, and what a well delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it's a comfortable finish in the end. 
which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, the ball is moving again, and Liverpool are giving this a real go. Enzo Fernandez. And support available. Can he finish? And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end. But I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. Goal. So back underway. 3-1 the score. Number two. That is that for the first half here. So the ball moving again. United having already made a big first half statement. Enzo Fernandez. Pele. And he's through here. Routine, really. Richarlison. Hakimi. On the ball. Richarlison. Oh, that's a fine pass. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. And an astute piece of defending. Pele. Salah. Ball's gone be a Liverpool ball and a double substitution it's going to be and this would reduce the deficit and he's done it so typical of Pele well let's take another look and wow how cleanly does he hit that the keeper was never going to save it what a good goal that is well, the action underway once more. No shortage of entertainment. 3 2. 15 minutes left for play. And he has options available. Pele. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, this could square the game. It has to be, surely. And a goal it is. The keeper ready that part of the equation. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. And they've been getting two substitutes warmed up, and both will come on here. Well, I imagine there were many who had counted them, and that is that a point apiece. They cannot be separated from the Liverpool point of view. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, the draw is a fair result in the end because they never really looked in full control of the game, which is disappointing when you consider the quality of their squad. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary, and alongside me is Stuart Robson, and getting ready for a potentially thrilling contest. It's Barcelona versus Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Aware of a 
threat solving the problem. Moving it forward. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. Must take the lead here. A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Goal. And Barca get the ball moving United. once more. How will they Number react? Usman Dembele. And support available. Well, they really had to be on their toes defensively, given the circumstances. Zinedine Zidane. Just the challenge that was required. Throw in here for Barcelona. And it's this could level it. And it nestles in the back of the net. Barca are level. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no goal. stopping that. So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Bellingham. And moving the ball nicely. And he clears the danger. Neymar. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Gakpo. Pele. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. And it's in! The back and front. Stunning scenes here. Well, just look at this again. He's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. goal. So the ball Manchester rolling United. again. Can Barca Number fight 10. back here? Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. May I please remind you that racism will not be tolerated in any form. And offenders will be removed from the stadium. And, and the ball moving again. Advantage United, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns here. Pele. Can he open the door to a potential goal? And the flag has gone up. Well, he has to work a lot harder to stay onside there. He didn't read the situation at all. Hakimi. Griezmann. Enzo Fernandez. And the keeper did more than enough. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Just the clearance that was called for. Neymar. Paredes. Neymar. Well, the danger is still there. Now, keeper getting both gloves on the ball. Cleared away. Into the final 20 minutes. Now, options are plenty. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now, a throw in. And a substitution in the offing. Moussa Diaby. And Bellingham. On to Pele. Pele! A very timely interception. And nearing full time, United inching ever closer to victory. Can they hang on? Stuart, your thoughts as regards their performance? Well, it's been a decent performance from them. They've certainly played the more expansive football and had the better individuals. Can they now just see this through? Not long left. 
Pele. And there it is, the final whistle. It's a Manchester United victory. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It is Manchester United up against Bayern Munich. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Hakimi, Griezmann, well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Rafael Leao, on the ball, Rafael Leao. And just wide of the post with a header. Griezmann. Bellingham. Oh, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Pedri. Dembele. It is a decent looking attack here. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Griezmann. Dembele. Bellingham. Congratulations to today's lucky fan of the match, Santi Jaramillo. Please Gaspol. come to guest relations to claim your prize. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. Goal it's a really good goal. Manchester United. Well, as Bayern get the ball Number moving 10. again, how will they react? And Bayern, the recipients of the free kick here. And cleared away. It's going to be United's free kick. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Oh, yes! Dispatching it with a plum! Wonderful goal! Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box. Begging players to attack it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Might be able to produce from this position. Tempele. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. 
Alfonso Davies. Promising move this from Bayer. And the attack showed promise, but easy work for the keeper in the end. And does well to keep it in play. He continues his run, but nothing comes of it. And he clears the danger. But following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. Here's a change for Manchester United. And you're not going to bamboozle the goalkeeper with a corner like that. Hakimi. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Pelé. Pedri. Dembele on the ball. Well, if Bayern could find a late winner here, it might be decisive. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Routine, really. And there it is, the full-time whistle. Well, they can't be separated. And goals very much part of the equation. Really Stuart, as always, football. interested to get your really final analysis. Well, Derek, it was a really good game between two evenly matched teams. Both had their moments, but neither side really deserved to lose this one. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Manchester United up against Pauk. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Gakpo. Into the advanced position. Not to be in terms of the finish. Jude Bellingham. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Messi. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Can they forge ahead? And denied by the first. Well, a time for composure on the ball. Regained possession. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Enzo Fernandez. Loris has it. Fernandez. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, he was a long way from goal, but that didn't seem to bother him. Well, he won't strike a football much better than that. That certainly had the keeper worried. <laughs> Bellingham. Yes, man. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 now, minutes in this game. Racism will not be tolerated in any form. And offenders will be removed from the stadium and 
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Teo Hernandez. Cue. Teo Hernandez. And a tidy ball. And a goal! Now they've broken through. One nil here. Well, here it is again. He's alive for the situation. He makes good contact with the ball and he keeps it down. That's a nice headed goal. So, so long away nice. again here. One nil to score. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Kaká. Lionel Messi. Great opportunity. And a struggle to get it away properly. Hakimi. And the referee has given the corner. So maybe scope here for them to add to their lead. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. He succeeds in clearing it. Now, what can Lionel Messi do from here? Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Lionel Messi. Well, what a good stop to keep them in this. Well, that would have been game over. Not long left now, though. And they will make the change now. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Lionel Messi. Furner. Firing it towards him. And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. And there is the final whistle for the great news from the Manchester United point of view is that United haven't picked up anything from this game. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It is Bayern Munich up against Manchester United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Leal. In it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Good-looking sequence. Pele, 
timely intervention. And the keeper showing tremendous command. This could be the equaliser. Well, really stout defending there. Off the line. Alfonso Davies. And he read it well defensively. Can he find the right pass? Well, trying his luck from a long way out, but the keeper saw it all the way. And he clears the danger. Fernandez. Well, a top notch piece of defensive judgment. Rafael Leao. Joshua Kimmich. And Bayern moving the ball with purpose. Oh, surely. How did he manage to reach that? Hugo Lloris. Well, he took care of it defensively. Hakimi. Really good challenge. Pele. Gakpo. Oh, big opportunity. Oh, my goodness. He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, Manchester lots of power, United. and the keeper just can't Number react in time. It's a great strike. Jude that is that for the first half here. So back underway here into the second half. And Bellingham... Well, they keep the ball moving. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Rafael Leao. And a good-looking pass. Take it away. Gakpo. Riesman. Pele. Moving forward effectively. Well, the danger is still there. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Can they forge ahead? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Making sure nothing came of it. Griezmann. An astute piece of defending. And he's through here. Really digging in at the back. But still the opportunity. Just ten minutes remaining here. Dembele. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, it still could be dangerous. Rafael Leao. And that is going to be all for this game. Well, we were treated to goals, but no winners in the end. Stuart, what did you make of it? Well, guys, it was certainly entertaining. Both sides had periods of the game where they were dominant, but overall, I think the draw is just about the right result. Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather.
My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It is Bayern Munich versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And that was a very fine read. Can they take the lead here? Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Jude Bellingham. Gakpo. And sloppy in possession. Bellingham, Hakimi, Pele, well, nicely cut out, Jamal Musiala, as clean as a whistle that challenge. Bayern throw in coming up. to win it back high up the pitch Fernandez Pavard Pele Musiala this is looking threatening can he put it away and offside just as he was ready to pounce Double personnel change here for Bayern. So back underway here into the second half. Well, he's certainly not alone. Alfonso Davies. Pele! Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, and then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. And as Bayern get the ball moving again, how will they react? How can he take them on and beat them? How can they open up the defence here? Clears it away. Man. Dembele well the clearance half-hearted plenty of support here Griezmann over the byline hence a goal kick and Bayern to bring on not one but two substitutes Jude Bellingham. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Raum. Kai Havertz. This could level it. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. Well, they've decided to make a change. Not cleared away completely. And a time for cool heads. Can they trouble the opposition this time?
Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Not the best clearance. And I think the threat has been averted. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of that performance also? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It is Manchester United up against Juventus. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Chance for Dembele! And the keeper stretching to deny him. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. And a fine tackle. Juventus keep possession, and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Can they forge ahead? And a goal from Griezmann. And it's fair to say the best finishers in the world don't really have to think about it. They just do it. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly, and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. So back in action. It's up to United now to be inventive. Davies. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. And he did what he had to do defensively. He continues his run. And Bellingham. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. Oh, maybe the equalizer. And it's in. A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now. Level. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Goal so the ball is rolling again at one all. Nice-looking pass. And that attack going up a dead end. And the keeper has the ball. Perfect challenge. Dembele. It's there for him. And a goal! It's a finish of real class. No shortage of acrobatics on display here. He's judged it to perfection. Incredible header. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box. Just begging for a teammate goal. to get on the end of it. Four and it ends up with a fairly United. simple finish. Certainly not Number much two. the goalkeeper can do about that. Underway once more, Manchester United have hit the front. Now well, the attack will peter out, keeper's ball. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. May I please remind you that racism will not be tolerated in any form. The defenders will be removed from the stadium. And, and they commence the second half. It's Juventus trailing tonight. Griezmann gets himself into the attacking third with the ball at his feet. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Promising pass. Well, such a high degree of difficulty. Not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. 
cleared away comprehensively. United have been getting two substitutes ready, and both will come on. Eder Militao. Bellingham. Pedri. Pele. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Ronaldinho. Ronaldinho. Now Griezmann. No nonsense clearance. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And not quite accurate enough, Stuart. Well, I think he should do better there, but at least they're now knocking at the door. Pedri. Gakpo. Ten minutes to go. And teammates around him. Diaby. Now with Pele. Enzo Fernandez. Oh, Jack! And turned onto the woodwork. Hakimi. And that will be all for this game anyway. And defeat for the visitors, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, Gareth, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable calls. It's Manchester United versus Marseille. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Zanetti. Cantona. Zanetti. Oh, goodness me, off the ball. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, they can keep possession now. Gakpo. Pele. Can he put them in front? Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Not away completely. with the goalkeeper oh what an opportunity couldn't grab hold of it danger averted now with Cantona Zanetti oh a vital interception has a go, and that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Hakimi, Griezmann, Fernandez.
Enzo Fernandez. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. And so it is, the first half story has been written. May I please remind you that racism will not be tolerated in any form. The defenders will be removed from the stadium. And Underway then the in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Fernandez. Griezmann. Perfect tackle. Well, he's lost the ball. Promising looking attack from Marseille. Fans, a reminder, throwing any items. Now they stopped them in their tracks. The well, from that ball. position, you and really should be doing more to work the stadium. goalkeeper. Thank you for your Well, they have been getting three substitutes warmed up. And by the look of it, all three are coming on. Hakimi. Dembele. Now with Hakimi. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. But they dealt with the threat posed. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Strong but fair tackle. Opportunity it is. And still a chance. He succeeds in clearing it. Pelé. And a tidy challenge. Rafael Leao, and given the situation, a goal at this stage might well turn out to be a winner. Oh, a vital save, and it remains all even. Well, there you have it. He may just have saved his team here. Well, they've decided to make a change. Can he finish? And turned on to the woodwork. There's still an issue here. Now, what can they do from here? Drogba must take the lead here. And what is that? This one will go into the history books as a draw. I wonder what we made of Olympic de Marseille's performance. Well, Derek, they are normally the better team, but that wasn't the case today because it was a below par display, and they just have to switch their focus to the next match now. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It is Borussia Dortmund versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And it's gone out of play for the Dortmund throw-in. And support available. Giroud. Magnificent defending. Bellingham. Jude Bellingham. Griezmann. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Pelé. Dembele. Congratulations Pele. to today's lucky and the player of the match, the Travis Holstein. Please come to guest relations to claim your prize. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. goal. Well, back on the way here. It's United. going to be interesting to see whether or not Dortmund can find the right reply. Diaby. 
Just cutting off the supply. Enzo Fernandez. Gakpo. Bellingham. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. Immobile. Diaby. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Well, he took care of it defensively. Pele. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Has left the building. And the ball moving again. Advantage United, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns here. Diakabi. They've got it now. What can they do? Mane. Olivier Giroud. Moussa Diaby. Giroud. It's a good Dortmund move in the making. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. And clears the danger. Bellingham. Out of play it goes, and it will be a throw-in. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. James. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw-in here. Casemiro, Martin Odegaard, can he take the chance? Big chance it is. Oh, right in the nick of time. Dembele. And into the last 15 minutes of action. And an astute piece of defending. Moussa Diaby. James. They have to be bold, Borussia Dortmund, in these circumstances. And Dortmund will go to the bench. Moussa Diaby. James. Good looking sequence. Well, the clearance half hearted. Well, threat averted. Pelé, and there it is, the final whistle, a result to please Manchester United fans around the world. The game, what do you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Poland taking on Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Not the best clearance. Well, no damage done. Jude Bellingham. Pele. Good tackle, take it away. And played the pass well. Brilliant save. Just wanted to get it out of there. And on to Cantona. 
Hakimi. He's in with a chance. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. And still dangerous. Wonderful chance. In it goes. The opening goal in this contest. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. Number seven. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. And Bellingham. And he did what he had to do defensively. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Given away by Manchester United. As Zanetti. How did he manage to reach that? Hugo Lewis. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. So, back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Well-timed tackle. And a clear foul, but the referee could reduce the deficit. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. And no nonsense defensive clearance. And there it is, the half time whistle. Coming up at half time, there will be a display from the police dog display team. So stay in your seats for that. So the ball rolling again, and no sugar coating it. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response in the second 45 from United? Cantona. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat trick. Well, here's the replay, and as you can see, Hakimi's cross is played into a really dangerous area and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Number seven. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Rodri Son plenty of support here in the right place to cut out the pass a quarter of an hour remaining here and keeping it on the ground slightly off target however so making the substitution now Zanetti and the danger clear Pele Pedri Tempele not fantastic defending let's see if it helps the opposition well they pulled one back but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here it is again. And when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that. It's a poor clearance. And suddenly, the ball's in the back of the net. Manchester United. And so there Number it is, 22. the final whistle. And Jude Manchester United Bellingham. have lost this game, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out.
Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Sporting versus Manchester United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Griezmann. Dembele. Fernandes. And he keeps going. Can they forge ahead? Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, perfect contact, and a brilliant finish. Top stuff. So on they go again. Will there be a response from Sporting here? There needs to be. Brazilians to shut them down and coolly done despite the mounting pressure. Griezmann, Dembele, Hakimi. It is a decent looking attack here and the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Just the clearance that was called for. And Bellingham, a real opening now. <laughs> Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, we've almost reached the halfway mark here. Manchester United on top. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts so far. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Wonderful piece of tackling, Virgil van Dijk. Tempele. Oh, a vital interception. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time now, please here. Remind you that racism will not be tolerated in any form. The defenders will be removed from the stadium. The second half underway. United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Decisive punch by the keeper. Really getting stuck in. Nice looking pass. Big chance to get them on terms. And cleared away. So a half an hour remaining. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Prepare to take on the shot. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Tempele. Well, still an issue here. It's a perfect challenge. Playing advantage here, United keep it. Well, it was one foul too many, and the referee simply had to blow for the free kick. And the substitution will occur now. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, desperately close to going in that time. Fernandes. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. Oh, they've lost it. Adji. Phil Foden. Are still pressing for a goal here.
Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box. Just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And then what a great finish as well. Good. So the final whistle and the end of an evenly fought contest, but focusing on the hosts, what about their performance? Well, Derek, they're normally the better team, but that wasn't the case today because it was a below-par display, and they just have to switch their focus to the next match now. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson, and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It's Arsenal up against Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Pelé, Griezmann, Pelé, well he says only not alone, superb defensive judgment to end the attack, an effective ball and he's through here, and a goal, just what the fans wanted to see, the ideal way to begin. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. 1-0 then. For Arsenal. Number 13, Neymar Jr. Well, spot on with that challenge. Tempele. Hakimi. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Jude Bellingham. Dembele. Bellingham. Pele. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Really good high press. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Alfonso Davies. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. And fired against the crossbar. Well, no danger now. Gakpo. Plenty of support here. And he did what he had to do defensively. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Coming up at half-time, there will be a display from the release dog display team. So stay in your seats for that. Back underway then, and work to do for United, given the scoreline. Perfect challenge. Well, they need to get tighter. And it's in! A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So underway again here, on the back of that leveller. And he might be through here. And offside by a very small margin.
So making the substitution now. Pelé. Into the advanced position. Fernandez. And reading it absolutely superbly. Neymar. Pelé. Mane. Wonderful tackle. And Bellingham. Oh, the goalkeeper did well to hang on to that one. Moussa Diaby. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Pele. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Jude Bellingham. They're showing a willingness to attack, as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. It's still alive. Verassi, this could be the equaliser. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. So the final whistle now. Yes, Darren, they were well off their usual standards today, and with the quality that they have in their squad, I think it's fair for the fans to demand more. Too many bystanders for me, just not good enough. Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Arsenal up against Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Well, from that position, he really should be doing more to work the goalkeeper. Griezmann. Enzo Fernandez. Eder Militao. Alfonso Davies. Gakpo. Can they make one of these passes count? But then the one that goes astray. Oh, he's through here. Loris. And played the pass well. Mane. overcome all the difficulties advantage Arsenal Gakpo well the goalkeeper dealt with it admirably Gakpo splendid tackle and a throw in coming up Bellingham. He succeeds in clearing it. Hakimi. And possession lost, intercepted. 
the first half here comes to an end. With the club secretary, please note, Mr. Moon has left the building. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Jude Bellingham. Can they forge ahead? And there it is, 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, let's take another look, and it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome. Goal On they go again. United. And Arsenal know they need to wipe Number out 10. that last goal. Mane. Good tackle. Throw into Arsenal coming up. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And Bellingham. Touched on to the woodwork. Well, a short corner here. And away by Pele. Griezmann. Encouraging stuff from United. But they dealt with the threat posed. Bellingham. Neymar. Now with Hakimi. Well, for United, it's almost a case of job done. Not quite yet, officially speaking. Stuart, what have you made of their performance today? Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game. But if they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well, and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Bellingham. Neymar. Jude Bellingham. The final whistle, and the Gunners go down. They've lost this game. No points picked Ladies up. What did you think of it? Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on Tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason. It's Paris Saint-Germain versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And they find a gap in the defence. And Bellingham. And on to Bellingham. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Tremendous intuition to win it back. And PSG pushing forward with options available. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. What a Mendy. Bellingham. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kick the outcome. really be able to trouble them here Pele 
Now Griezmann. Attention, and a goal That's from Leo Antoine Schiffer. Griezmann. Please come and that ought to give his team a massive finish. You. Thank you. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Goal. So, underway Manchester again here. 1-0 the score. Number 8, Antoine Griezmann. Gakpo. Can he take advantage? My goodness, that save. What a stretch he was. One for his own highlights reel. Still not clear. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volling home with precision and style. Superbly done. Well, let's look at this again. He judges the flight of the ball. He sets himself ready to strike it. And then he just hits it so sweetly. That's the perfect volley. Goal. So back Manchester underway United. with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Nonsense defensive clearance. And the problem not completely solved. Hulit. On to Cantona. Well, not the best clearance. And a fantastic diving save. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Corner again. Averted. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Coming up on time, don't forget we'll be having the Lucky Nut and also don't forget the Lucky Program. So the, the ball moving, moving again, program. United having already made a big first half statement. Well, they have it again. It's a fine United move in the making. Davies. Not really the ideal clearance. And a really good diving stop. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. Well, they can bring it out now. And the pass, a good one. Well, the flag has gone up. It was really close. PSG have been readying two substitutes, and now both will come on. And an astute piece of defending. Well, we're into the final half hour. Harry Kuehl. And he has options available. Well, not cleared away completely. And I think the threat has been averted. And that was a very fine read. Fuller. Correct. Woody Fuller. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Griezmann. Ten minutes left for play. It should be! There's the goal! Surely now, that is that! Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Goal. It's a massive Manchester lead, United. and it's very hard to imagine them Number losing 20. it now. Musa And Bellingham on to Fuller. And it's gone behind for the corner. And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation? 
frustration at this stage of the proceedings. They haven't been up the best. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. And there it is, the final whistle, a result to please Manchester United fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals, and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It is Bayern Munich taking on Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Chance to finish! A truly magnificent start! An early goal in the game, just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Well, on with the game. And will that goal have the effect of stinging Bayern Munich into action? Bayern pushing forward with options available. Dembele. Pele. Well, he's certainly not alone. Intercepting it intelligently. Rafael Leao. Richarlison. Has a go. Oh, superb technique. But off the frame of the goal. Well, it was a great effort. It takes a lot of skill to control the volley like that. It really is unlucky. Fernandez. Enzo Fernandez. More than decent this from United. Top class defending. Nice and easy for the keeper. Griezmann. Bellingham. Oh, so close to extending the lead. Well, that really would have put them in a commanding position, but it's still all to play for here. Hakimi. Griezmann. Pele. Jude Bellingham. The first half here comes to an end. Coming up at half-time, there will be a display from the police dog display team. So stay in your seats for that. And the ball moving again. Advantage United, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns here. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Pele! And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So back underway Manchester with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Good-looking sequence. Richarlison. My good, and pushed onto the woodwork. Bellingham. Tony Kors. Richarlison. Salah. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction.
deflection. Tremendous goal. Well, let's just see again how Salah delivered this cross into such a good area. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't goal react in time. Hits a great strike. Munich. And the ball is moving again, and Bayern Munich, Munich find soon. themselves within touching distance. And support available. Really vital interception here. Surely! And a penalty it is. Well, when you're behind in the game, you certainly don't want to be conceding spot kicks. And Bayern will change. Can he make a count? Save, but still a chance. Well, the clearance, half-hearted. Interception to snuff out the danger. Pele. Just ten minutes remaining here. It's offside, and perhaps he should have been a bit more alert. And maybe a little bit more aware in the box. He was just too static. Given away by Manchester United. Bayern late in the game, battling against the clock and the scoreline. Oh, really? A touchdown to the frame of the goal. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three Ladies points gentlemen, for them. The what did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Dembele. Casemiro acquitting himself magnificently to win it back. Straight offside, but only just. Intercepting it intelligently. Pelé. Hakimi, Dembele, Bellingham, looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead, and over the touchline for what will be a Dortmund throw. Pele, Mane, Chiro Immobile, really in with a chance, not problematic for the keeper. Dembele, Bellingham, and he was in the right place to intercept. Moussa Diaby, and that'll be a Dortmund throw-in. Moussa Diaby. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. 
Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, goal. leaving the keeper Number with little chance. It's a great goal. Number 10. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. So the ball is rolling again. United might be behind, but still plenty of time for them. What can they do in the second 45? Nicely timed tackle. And a throw in here for United. Plenty of support here. And he read it well defensively. Not away completely. Well, he almost headed it in. Enzo Fernandez. Fernandez. Getting forward. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. No nonsense clearance. Well, as you can see, he's a dangerous runner with the ball. He has such good balance and pace. That's a top-class goal, isn't it? Two substitutes on at once for Borussia Dortmund. Goal and the ball is moving Borussia again. Zinedine how it stands. <laughs> Teammates available. Firing is in. Oh, incredible save, and he's snuffed out the danger. And cleared away. Giving it a try. Not finished yet. Not quite yet. Still excitement left in the game. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Goal for Manchester Substitution it is for Dortmund. Number five. So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Casemiro. Alfonso Davies. Well, he had to read it and get there, and did. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. And the danger cleared. And there's the final whistle. The grim news from the Manchester United point of view is that United haven't picked up anything from this game. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace of me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Manchester United, and they face Dinamo Kiev. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. and he might be through here and intercepts again will it be oh tremendous goal technical excellence to finish that one off wonderful to have that in your repertoire well as you
as you can see, that's a great bit of skill. He times this so sweetly. What a good goal that is. So underway again here. 1-0 the score. Bruno Fernandez. Alert defending. And he's taken it away. Bellingham. Alfonso Davies. Griezmann. Gakpo. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. They need to get tighter. Patient build up at the moment. Pele. This could level it. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Goal for so, Manchester a level United. Contest. One one. Number eleven. How can he take them on and beat them? And he did what he had to do defensively. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. Oh, he's given us away. Dembele. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Cleared away. Dembele. Danger averted. That is that for the first half here. May I please remind you that racism will not be tolerated in any form. And offenders will be removed from the stadium. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Oh, that's... Oh, in with a chance! And a goal! Well, as you can see, he gets there first, he makes good contact with the ball and finds the back of the net. That's a decent header. So on they go again, and that really should shake up United. Can they find a response now? Griezmann. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. He has teammates around him. But he keeps going. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Can they stop it going in? Clears it away. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Bellingham. Dembele, promising sequence. And Bellingham must take the lead here. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Dembele, on the struggle to get it away properly. And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front.
Well, here it is again. And when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that. It's a poor clearance, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the visitors. That's the big story. Well, Derek, today just wasn't good enough. They lacked a cutting edge, they played too slowly, and they made many mistakes at the back. It was really disappointing. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It's Manchester United taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. They stopped them just when they looked menacing. Hakimi. Good technique displayed. It's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Gakpo, Dias, Pele, Enzo Fernandez, Bellingham, Fernandez, plenty of support here. Good looking sequence, it might still be problematic. Read it superbly to take back possession. Prepare to take on the shots. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Can he put them in front? And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Vinicius Junior. Pele. Eder Militao. And that was a very fine read. Teo Hernandez. He continues his run. But nothing comes of it. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Hernandez and with that the first half draws to a close with the club secretary please note Mr. Moon has left the building into the second half then and these two sides are locked together just can't really choose between them at the moment Vinicius Junior can he take the chance Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? And they need to get tighter. And the verdict of the officials is offside. Well, he just gets caught ball-watching here needs to be more alive work harder to keep on side and be ready for the chance <laughs> a 
Hakimi. Dembele. And reading it absolutely superbly. Andre Silva. Silva. 20 minutes remaining. Out of play, Real Madrid throw here. Here's a change for Manchester United. Eduardo Camavinga. Can he make it count? And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Time for a change then. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Ten minutes to go. Gakpo. And Bellingham. And the danger still on. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Vinicius Junior. Drogba. And the referee blows the full time. The big headline here, defeat for United. Your assessment of the game. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the board in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It is Manchester City up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, as you can see, he gets there first, he makes good contact with the ball and finds the back of the net. That's a decent header. So on they go again, and that really should shake up United. Can they find a response now? There to win it back. Effective looking pass. And he's made headway. Great work defensively, but still the chance. Good tackle taken away. Couldn't hang on to the ball. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? And City get the throw in. Firing it in. How did he manage to reach that? Hugo Lloris. Oh, surely. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and then what a great finish as well. 
good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Back in action then, and you sense United have the momentum at the moment. And the advantage is with City. And they stopped them in their tracks. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Alfonso Davies. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Tempele went in strongly to win the ball. Opportunity maybe for United here. Magnificent stuff and quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, let's take another look and there's the deflection. And from that moment on, the keeper had no chance, did he? So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Good looking pass. Nice and easy for the keeper. That is that for the first half here. So back underway here into the second half. Disadvantage Manchester City here. This time, however, it will be a free kick. Thwarted by the post. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? And with that, they thwarted the opportunity. And the danger cleared. Firing it towards goal. And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. And Manchester City will go to their bench. So back in business. Can Manchester United bounce back? Well, they've given him too much space. Speculative effort. It'll be hard for us to find a better save than that. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Goal for so the current scoreline, 4 2. Number 16. Pedri. Well, no stopping him. Pele. And a goal! Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Goal for well, how about this? 4-3. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Marcos Acuna... Yeah, this could finish it. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. And the referee blows for full time. The big headline here, the beat for United. Your assessment of the game. Well done. They were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the ball in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out.
Well, the weather forecaster has promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It is Manchester United up against Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Seemed to switch off for a moment, and now a throw in. And United will get the throw in. Enzo Fernandez, Gakpo, Alfonso Davies, Fernandez, Jude Bellingham. Interception to snuff out the danger. Pelé, Dembele, and Dembele has given it away. Out of play, United throw in coming up. Dembele, Bellingham, Dembele on the ball. And stuffing out the danger. Kylian Mbappe, Eric Cantona. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Dembele, and he's in. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Pele, and here's Dembele. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Coming up at half time, there will be a display from the release dog display team. So stay in your seats for that. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Top class defending. And Emiliano Martinez has it. Hakimi. Now with Hakimi. Bellingham. A top chance for Dembele. And foiled only by the crossbar. Kaká. He's in here. Promising pass. Must take the lead here. And with that, they thwarted the opportunity. Fernandez. Jude Bellingham. Gakpo. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Attention, Jonathan Hayes. That's Jonathan oh, Hayes. Please meet your leader. Thank you. Will that be the one that gives them the win? Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Goal for well, they have Manchester elected to United. go to the bench at Number this stage four. of the game. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Modric, and on to Bellingham. Cantona, this could be the equaliser. Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. Pele. He has teammates around him. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Oh, a smart save to 
to keep the minute. Well, that keeps it interesting, but they're running out of time here. Just straying offside. And the referee blows for full time. The big headline here, defeat for United. Your assessment of the game. Yes, Derek, they were well off their usual standards today. And with the quality that they have in their squad, I think it's fair for the fans to demand more. Too many bystanders for me, just not good enough. Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on Tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason, it is Juventus versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. First goal of the game. Well, just look at this. He's so alive to the situation. That's a neat headed goal in the end. Goal. Back underway. And 1 0 it is. Let's see what Lionel happens next. Messi. Bellingham. It's neat passing. Confidence on the ball. No nonsense clearance. 